To locate transcription factor binding sites in GeneQuest, first open a sequence file. In this case, I'm going to use worm problem final result from the laser gene demo data. And you'll see that this file already has some GeneQuest methods applied. It's also been annotated with a gene. Now to locate transcription factor binding sites, I'm going to go to more methods, patterns, signals, tfd.dat. This method finds transcription factor binding sites using species specific sequence patterns. Right click on the method and choose method parameters to change which source organism to search. In this case, I'll choose other and the site length you want to search for. In this case, I'll choose short. By default, GeneQuest uses the tfd.dat file installed with LaserGene for all of the source organism and site information. However, you can use your own transcription factor database if you have one. Then click OK. And GeneQuest will locate all the patterns that meet the criteria we selected. Now I'm going to click the plus icon to reveal all the patterns that were located. And at this point, I can apply any of these patterns to my sequence simply by selecting one and dragging it onto the assay. So here we can see the places along the sequence where the Tata Box 2 pattern is found. To see more information on any of these hits, simply click and hold to see the pattern name, sequence, percent match, and whether the pattern was found on the top or bottom strand. You can also see detailed information about a transcription factor by selecting a pattern and then going to Sites and Features, Lookup Site, Description. This will open the DNA Star Transcription Factor Database in your web browser. Here you can read about the transcription factor description and PubMed references. Another way to locate transcription factor binding sites is by manually typing in a pattern to locate. To do this, go to More Methods, Patterns, Type in Pattern. Then right click and select method parameters. And here you can type in the sequence pattern to locate. Optionally, you can change the threshold for the sequence match. I'm going to leave this at 100 and click OK. Then click the plus icon to show the pattern I just added and drag it onto the assay surface. If you have further questions about locating transcription factor binding sites in GeneQuest, or any other questions about our software, please visit our website, dnastar.com, or contact us at support at dnastar.com.